Jerusalem, 1194 AD, third year of the Third Crusade. Arab Dungeon Sunset. Huh, sucks to be you guys. Help me, Robin. Can't hold out any longer. I got you, bro. Hey, knock it off. Quiet, Englishman, or your turn will be twice as long. Well, never mind, dude. I can't have. Oh, never mind. I got a knife. I got you, bro. Ha! Free at last. Not unless we get out of here. Lead the way. I'll try to keep up. Peter has joined Robin's band. Door is locked. This is not what I was expecting from a Robin Hood game. Break it down. Uh, if I can just figure out where to go. Ah, maybe that's it. Now, I don't like the fact that I got all these options, though. I got, uh, search. Finds a hidden door key. Yeah. Oh, okay, so, like, when you search, it clears, like, the entire fucking area. That's weird. Hey, what's up, dude? Free me, and I'll show you the way out. Why should I trust you? If you don't, we are all dead. Well, sure do. Thank you, my friend. I am Azim. There's a secret passage under the floor at the southeast corner. I also hit a door key nearby. Southeast corner. Robin Hood is in here at prison. He's nothing of interest. He's nothing. Okay, wasn't... I'm confused. Didn't he say southeast corner? I mean, I guess it depends on what's north and what's... If you consider this north, and this south, this would be southeast corner, unless, like, I gotta be here. <clears throat> Assume it's in southeast corner of the whole area, not just this room. Yeah, I was thinking that too, but the door's locked, so... Again, if you consider that north, this south, this east, southeast corner would be here. Might be. I mean, he said he didn't. He said he hid the key near. Oh, okay. Never mind. I, I thought he said he hid the key near um where he was. Whatever. <clears throat> Prepare to die, infidel. Oh shit! And then we got this. What is? Ah, uh, that works. Victory, your foe is defeated. Uh, I took 19 damage. Alright, so yeah, I don't think it's here. I think it's down right there on the right. What the hell are these? Boom! We must move quickly, they will come after us. The fight was brutal, but so was the flickering. <laughs> it's weird because you got like two different fighting systems. You got this right here, and then it goes into combat with like special fights. Oh no, okay! Oh no, no he just walked into me and said die infidels and I took uh, damage. I just took damage there, that sucked. He blew up I think. I think he actually blew up and I took damage. Which that seems really racist. Cause we're, uh, wasn't this, like, I don't know, maybe I'm being racist. Didn't they say, like, at some point in time, like, some of these people are Arabs or whatever? Arabians? Or am I just crazy? Cause, like, see, they blow up, and I took damage from that, so I feel like they're actually blowing up. Which I don't get, cause aren't we supposed to be in Jerusalem? I'm so confused about why they're blowing up. Because I think I'm actually taking damage. Like, when that one guy died, he blew up, and I'm pretty sure I took damage from the explosion. Why are they blowing up? I 
But yeah, I figured Paperboy probably ended after a week. But I just, dude, I couldn't do it. I got, the best I did was I got to Wednesday. You start on Monday. There's just so much bullshit. Our escape lies just to the north. Oh no, they're surrounding us. Fight for your lives! Oh, shit. What is this game? No, here's what's weird. This entire time, B has been my uh, button to attack. Now it's A. This game couldn't decide, des decide on combat systems. Get him, boys. Good job. You managed to defeat the guards, but not without casualties. Who died? I am badly wounded, Robin. Hold on to my soldier, Peter. We must hurry. My wound is mortal. I can go no further. We must hurry. More guards are coming. I will delay the guards as long as I can. Make your escape. Take this ring to my sister. Swear you will protect her for me. Swear it, Robin. I swear it. Why does that look like, um... Fuck, what's his name? <sighs> Whatever. Let's go. Make a sacrifice an act of honor. I have 7 HP, dude. I got wrecked. I think I might have potions, though. Player. Oh, whoa! Dude, what is this? Robin Hood drops the yellow potion. Motherfucker! David Hasselhoff, that's the name. I couldn't think of his name. I was thinking Baywatch guy. What's the Baywatch guy's name? Yeah, that's who I look that's what I thought he looked like too, is Hasselhoff. See, that's what I thought. Like I thought Kevin Costner was the so why does it look so much like Hasselhoff? Nothing happens. Drops the weapon. Quit fucking dropping potions! Explain to me why both of those icons was to drop. I figured one would be to, like, use. Narrowly escaped the guards with their lives. After a ten-month journey fraught with peril, Robin and Azima at last reached the shores of England. God damn it, man. I needed to heal. Are you a bad guy? Because I'm almost dead. Hello, young man. The rule of England has fallen since King Richard left to fight the Crusades. A, rick, a wicked tyrant, Sheriff Nottingham, is ruling the land with an iron fist. By the way, Sheriff Nottingham, excellent board game. He steals all we have and burns any villages which oppose him. No one has been able to stop him. Oof, that's fucking dramatic. Pick that up, pick that up, whatever, just grab. I'll buy and select. It probably, probably was ma uh, mouth, right? Ooh, this dope ass map. What am I stuck? What? What? Where? Huh? What? Okay. Well, let's try. We got a potion. Potion. Mouth. Hey! Yep. Boom! 100 HP. That's what we're fucking talking about. Just call the French and ask him to evade and take out the evil sheriff. I'm sure they're down for it. <laughs> I love how, like, they die. You see a number two pop up. Right next to the 100? What the hell is that? Is there, like, an experience? Oops, I didn't mean... Near Herman's wall, he sees nothing much of Player. Is, like, an experience or something like that? Azim! Hey, shit. Look at that. And, like, a Azim shit. Because I'm trying to figure out why that 2 keeps popping up.
too. Oh, I just took so much damage right there. Robin! I hear some noises to the noises to the north. Well, let's go investigate these noises. Welcome home, Waxley. I'm Guy of Gisborne, the sheriff's cousin. So glad you came to me. You saved me the trouble of finding you. Kill him, men. Ah! Yeah, I figured we'd get back into the screen. I don't like this screen. I took so much damage last time I had to do this. Ha! Guess what? I found the fucking spawn point. You guys are screwed. You done spawn on here, mm, dumbasses? It didn't go very well for you, did it? Victory! Robin finds a chest key, two bags of gold, and some leather armor among the remains. I'll take that, shit. We shall meet again, Loxley. You will pay. No, I don't think I can. I can control my guy, that's all I was able to really control. <laughs> that's fucking awesome! You just move it over there and place it. <laughs> ah, lord. Yeah, where's the bow at? Azim got it? I have no idea where the bow's at. I picked it up. No idea. The only thing I can think of is like might be a special attack that I can activate or something. Oh, is it in Azim's hands? I didn't even think about looking at his hands. It is! Azim, you dirty fucker. Come here. Give me that. What's the matter with you? Hey, bro. Why don't you have a weapon on, Azim? Get your fucking life together! The longbow requires both hands to use. Um... We can't. We can put it on Azim. What is it? The problem is we don't know what the fucking ring does. I don't want to put it on Azim because, honestly, I don't trust him. And I gotta give it to What's-Her-Face. We'll just keep it like that. Boom! What's this do? Oh, dude, this bow is fucking awesome. Look at this shit. Thanks for saving me from Nottingham's men. This is my land, and they have no business here. You obviously don't know Nottingham. My father, John Little, is now an outlaw. Outlaw for feeding his family. I better go before they return. By Loxley. Who's Loxley? Is that like Robin Hood's like actual name or something? I know nothing about Robin Hood. Drag the ring to your eye. <laughs> All right. The name Marian Dubius is engraved in the ring. Hey, look at that. Very smart. That actually worked. The chest key weighs one unit. The apple weighs one unit. Alright, so these are apples. So this is a torch, right? The torch weighs one unit. Boom. Arrows. Oh shit, wait, if I'm picking up arrows, that's not good. Because I've been sitting here wasting arrows. Ah, I will in a second. I'm hoping like I could find a town here in a little bit and that'll heal me. You fucking wreck, dude! Wait, what was that screen? What was the little screen? All I did was I went to the inventory and switched to Azim. Bunch of stats? I... no? I don't think so. That would have been nice, but I don't think... No idea then. We're almost there. Just where the hill lies, the prettiest castle in all England. Hot food and a real bed. Azim. Home. No idea.
Castle. How the fuck do I get in the castle? More arrows. Saw a guy hanging from the ledge, it looked like, which is pretty funny. It's like right down here. But... I can't tell what I can walk on or not, because I figured I couldn't walk in this area, but I can. Oh shit! He's not hanging. He's pinned up there. Oh, fuck, 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 fuck! Alright, we handled that pretty well, actually. That scared the fucking bejesus out of me. Wasting error. Oh! What the fuck?! I didn't even see that! Yeah, because it says I just paused at the right time. Level 1, experience 58 out of 100, hit points. How the hell did I get to that screen? I didn't even see it. I thought you were just on drugs. Ah! If I'm in this screen and I hold select. So I got 64 arrows. Sixty-three arrows. So yeah, those numbers popping up are exactly what I thought. It's experience. Whoop! Well, fuck, man. Alright, hold on. I'm gonna switch out the bow. Because I don't want to keep using the bow. I'm gonna eat an apple. We're gonna steal this back from him. I wanna try to conserve the arrows for like boss fights or something. Hold on. We can put the ring on now. Way ahead of you, dude. That fucking apple healed for like nothing. Master Robin, is it you? Duncan? I thought you had abandoned us. Duncan, my father. Master Robin, you're here. It's a miracle. Are you deaf, Duncan? What happened to my father? A miracle. A miracle. You left him to hang like a common thief. Why didn't you cut him down? Why? Easy, Robin. Look at his eyes. They took my eyes, Robin. Who? Who did this to you? Guy of Gisborne, with the sheriff and his witch... Mortiana? I assume Mortiana, looking on. I will not rest until my father's avenged. Your father's medallion, the symbol of Loxley, is yours now. Take it. Wear it with honor your father did. It's not safe here. We had better go before Gisborne returns. Yes, I must see Marion. Duncan has joined Robin's band. Yeah, like, it amazes me that the guy had to point out, like, dude, Robin, look at his fucking eyes, man. He's got bandages over them. I think he's fucking blind. Oh, hey, look at this. This guy's got fucking food. I'm stealing this from you. Fuck. 
Fuck yeah! Full HP? No, not even close. That's horrible. Hit the wrong button. Hey, I managed to the next level. What, what? That's exactly how I remember the movie going, too. Halfway through a castle, he just levels up. I just love though, he's fucking giving him shit. Guy's like, dude, I'm fucking blind. He took my eyes. Like, how about you point that shit out? Poor dude's blind and Robin doesn't give a rat's fucking ass. Now I'm kinda curious if they actually took his eyes, or they just blinded him. Cause huge difference. Humongous difference. It'd be weird if later on in the game you just come across the guy who's fucking juggling two eyeballs. It's like, whoa, they fucking took his eyes. Holy shit. These fucking bats, man. I'm just trying to explore the entire cast, and they just keep fucking appearing. Oh man, these poor bats. All right, I think I got a thing. I, I pickled them for optimal juggling. My poor father. At least I can give you a decent burial. Duncan and Azim help Robin in the sad task of burying his father. Sad, really? Now we got rats. Oh no, Loxley Castle in ruins. There you go before so the land. Father, where are you? Dude, I triggered that so backwards. So I went all the way around the castle and entered from the bottom, and then I was supposed to enter from here and trigger that fucking text. That's just so funny, like, I'm already in the castle, I already know what happened with his father, where his father's at, but it's like, oh no, my father, what happened to him? We just got done burying him. Did you forget about that ramen? It happened like two seconds ago. Oh my goodness. I wonder if I can hit him over the wall. Yep. <laughs> Prince of Amnesiacs. It's always funny though when like you can trigger a uh, game, like text. Or audio, whatever, like in opposite, like in the uh, opposite order, or just like the order they didn't intend. Cause it's just funny to me how awkward it is. Cause like right there, like oh no, this castle's in ruins. Where's my father? And it's like, dude, we've already went through all that shit. Cheap, 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 cheap. More arrows. Fuck. Right, where can I go? I gotta look at the map. I wonder how decent the map is. Ah, <sighs> fucking d garbage. That's how decent it is. Can I move it? Nope. Awesome. Alright, we're stealing your other leg of lamb. That healed me for nothing. Like, the first one healed me for a good bit. That healed me for, what, five? Six? I think six. Oh, for the love of God! Just stop spawning for a second. 
I'm gonna level up again just off these one uh, XP minions. Apparently that's all that's here is a castle. So I think I need to go back into the castle? But I doubt it, right? Like unless there was something I missed in there. Oh, for the love of... I hate the fact that I got the map, but I can't actually, like, move it around. And I can't make it bigger, so it's like, I get this little tiny fucking map. It takes a bunch to get to it, as well. Yeah, I mean, that's all it shows is that. Um... Uh, I, I, the only thing I can think of is there's something I missed inside the castle. But I thought I explored it pretty well. You can't take the em emblem lo on the floor. The Loxley emblem. Because, uh... I'm supposed to be searching for like Marion or Marion or however you say her name to give her the ring. That was awesome, he got stuck on the pillar. I just lost his fucking mind. I mean, I entered from on the right side, but like, I wonder if I can exit there still, because according to like, if you look at the map, it shows like it's just a bunch of X's. So I don't know if I can even exit there or not. <clears throat> God damn it! Are you kidding me? You can trigger this fucking text again? I wonder if I can trigger it again because I, uh, went the wrong order. Or, you know, it'd be really fucked up that I just soft-locked the game by doing it the way I did. No, my lock, that's what's happened. Just over that hill. No, because you can trigger this text again. Yeah, because I entered from right here, and it triggered that text right away. I have no idea. Ever level though. I had like I, I I don't know. I don't fucking know. I figured like I was supposed to come in here, see that guy, and then bury my father. So I should be outside now. But there's nothing outside for me. And I've searched all that, right? <sighs> I don't know. Does anybody got any ideas? Because I am fucking plumb out. Yeah, I'm about to level up again. I just leveled up. <coughs> leveled up off these bats. And why not? before, and I'm about to level again. And they only give one XP. That's how long I've been running around killing these fucking bats and rats and um, whatever else everything is. I've killed all, I've killed over 125 of them. Assuming that my zero, my experience went back down to zero. Motherfucker. I think that was like the exact same spot I leveled up before too. Probably this, which I saw before and I didn't.
Like, I really don't need that? Because I saw this before and I tried taking it, but it wouldn't let me. Ask the guy with no eyes where to go. I don't think I can. Yeah. I mean, he'd probably know where to go, though. He seems like a good guy. I... I... So I apparently don't need that. You came into this area from the right, try going left. I went left. I went left and went all the way up against the wall and shit, and there's nothing there. Because that's where I figured I was supposed to go, but... Unless I missed something. I'm glad I decided to switch to this and conserve arrows, because I'd be out of arrows by now. Alright, so let's try going to the left. Fuck off. You too. Uh, I was hoping for like a text box, but... Ooh, maybe this? I'm a fucking potato stick. I went like, I didn't go to the bottom left, I went to like the mid left and top left. But I, of course I didn't go to the bottom left. Actually, you know what? I knew that was there, I was farming experience. I just, I hate being under leveled. Dude, I'm getting my ass kicked. Oh! Hold on, nope, stop, stop chasing me. I need to heal. This is Dubu, Dubo, Du Bois, the something manor, home of Peter and his sister Marion. Du Bois. Let's check the map so we don't fucking walk the wrong way and make this longer than we need to. Gone, strangers. Mario Du Boo, Du Bois. Can I help you, motherfucker? Mm, hold on. Player. Put this on. Put that there. It's French. It's probably pronounced like Du Bois. Uh, yeah, that's what I was guessing, but I'm an idiot. I can't remember how it's pronounced. Be gone, strangers. I got the ring on, dude. Have a brother out. More arrows. Wow. Ooh. Horses. I love how search and uh, look seem to do the exact same fucking thing.
Um, okay. I figured, like, I had to use the ring in some way, shape, or form. I could drop it, but I don't... Maybe use? Maybe get in front of him and do use? Nothing happens. Fuck! God damn it! I meant to save state before doing that. Give my ring back. Fuck! Well, hopefully I don't need the ring. I meant to save state before that because I had a feeling that was gonna fucking happen. It's so stupid, the drop thing, it... Oh, I'm saying, these are both apparently take, and but also are drop, which makes no fucking sense. I'm gonna fucking end up needing that ring, aren't I? And holy shit, my HP right now. Apparently you can go above 100. Oh, fucking hell, dude. Oh, fucking hell. I mean, I can't even figure out how to get in the fucking castle anyway. <laughs> I'm gonna end up needing that fucking ring, dude. Oh no, I went up needing that ring and I just dropped it. Uh, I'm at the save state before I did that. Because I had a feeling that was going to happen. Because most games are like, hey, 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 you don't want to drop that. You need that. And they just want to let you do it. This game's like, oh, you want to join? Yeah, fuck it. We don't care. You can even pick it up. Once you drop it, it's gone. Is that what you want to do? Alright, see ya. I think at that point I would drop the cartridge of the game. <laughs> yeah. If I, the problem is I can't even figure out how to get in the goddamn castle, though. Like I said, I figured I'd have to, like, show him the rain, but hey, dude, look, look what I got. And he'd be like, oh, whoa, go right ahead, sir. But... I don't know. Uh, I don't know. I've wasted so much time just trying to figure out what to do in these areas. Ooh, apple. Ooh, piece of candy. Ooh, piece of candy. I can't get back out of this area either. I'm stuck in here. Because I was thinking maybe uh, there was something. I, I don't know. I don't know. No fucking idea. The only other thing I can really think of is just walk around the um, building that the guy's blocking and see if uh, there's just like a door somewhere I can get in. Fucking! Oh, 
I don't know. I am... Of course. Why did I never think of that? Alright, so I just read through this uh, FAQ. I just did uh, Control F, and apparently I don't need the uh, ring for anything, according to this guy. But apparently, what I was supposed to do is, according to what he says, is I need to take off my armor. And put the medallion in place of it. That's what he said to do. God damn it! I had the fucking medallion in my. That makes no sense. I had the medallion in my hand. That didn't work. Medallion on my chest. That works. I had I had the medallion on my ha in my hand, and I figured that would do well enough. But apparently, in your hands, not good enough. I actually had to equip it on my uh, chest for it to work. I didn't think it was going to be that specific. I figured if I had it equipped at all, it'd be okay. But, no. Go figure. I mean, how stupid of me. Jesus Christ, this is huge. Apparently there's a NES game of this too, so that means, uh, I think this is just a maze. Um, TMR played this. Hello, Mario. You have no business here, Loxley. Well, nope, I don't. You're right. I don't have any fucking business here, because I kind of dropped the fucking ring. So you are absolutely right, lady. picked up something. It looks like a chainmail to me, but... Yep, looks like chainmail. Yep, 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 yep. Does he even wear that, bro? Get to that guide real quick. I want to see. Make sure somebody has space to take the saddle that Maid Marion is going to give you. Well. Well, 
let's try talking to her again. Because there's a chance I might have uh, just fucked over the game by getting rid of that ring. Because I'm supposed to apparently talk to her and get a saddle, but um, she's telling me to fuck off instead. I just pick up. Alright, so that was the yellow potion. Why are you holding a potion in your hand, dude? Are you fucking... What's the matter with you? I think the yellow potion said yellow... Head north to the large door in the back. Grab the yellow potion and search the room. Alright, so apparently the large door in the back and this game, dude, I swear. Uh, let me go down then left. I'm gonna really pissed off if I gotta get that ring again. I'm gonna have to reset the game. <laughs> He's drinking it to forget his problems. Drinking it to forget the fact that he doesn't have eyeballs. Somebody took him. And like, that's one thing that really sucks is like the search feature. With like these keys. How are you ever supposed to know where you're supposed to search at? The key apparently is to unlock the door on the left that was locked. I think I might have fucked myself with that key though. to the guy that said, uh, extra room, head back down that hall and get to the room you pass on the left side to grab a loaf of bread and a leg of meat. Unlock the door there, enter, grab all these arrows. Come back out and go straight across to the right of the entrance and turn up the first hall to the north. This is room with the yellow potion. So apparently I'm supposed to be able to unlock this door with that key, but... Wait, hold on. Because I didn't see it in my inventory. I think What's-His-Face might be holding it. Yep! Duncan! You have issues, dude! It's a fucking key! What do you- You know what? I, I don't even care, Duncan. Don't even care. Yeah, I was sitting thinking about it, I was like, wait a minute, I didn't have the key, where the fuck- Uh, oh, Duncan's probably holding it, because he's a fucking lunatic. The search seems pixel huntish. Yeah, like, that's the big issue, is like- it's a, it'd be a lot of just every single- I don't know how big it is, like how big the area is. I assume probably the screens. Like right here, it'd search the entire thing. So it'd be a lot of time just going through and just searching. Because, I mean, there's probably a lot of hidden shit in this game. And if you're missing something, you don't know if it's because you just need a search or if you just haven't picked it up because you didn't get the right way or something. Now let's hope that What's-Her-Face gives me the saddle, which I doubt she does. Because I'm pretty sure I need the fucking ring. <sighs> yeah.
I don't get it because he doesn't even talk about the ring ever. Like, he doesn't like he barely even suggests the guy dying. Like, even talking about the guy dying either. Because like, all it says is, take this room, take this to the room with Maid Marion. Before you talk to her, stand over the chainmail, pick it up. Make sure you have space available to get the saddle that Maid Marion is going to give you when you talk to her. Yeah, I, I have no fucking idea. I really clueless. Like, they don't, like, and I... I don't know. Because it doesn't say to have that on. I try that, though, but... Well, there's another guy. Let me read that one. It probably will fucking tell me. Yeah, you need the key, dumbass. Yep. It says, yeah, this other guy says, talk to her, give her the ring. And, yep. Oh, shit, I reset the timer. Well, I gotta get used to the restroom, and then I gotta look up the VOD to fucking f figure out what the timer is at. Alright, 52.30 is close enough. It doesn't need to be exact, considering the fact I wasted a fucking shitload of time anyway. Figuring out what I needed to do. like a fucking about half an hour or something like that just trying to figure out what the hell to do
Fuck. So much damage. Problem is, like, running around collecting everything again. Because I don't remember where everything was, and a lot of that shit's really fucking helpful. The problem is, like, how much shit might just be sitting here, you know what I mean? Where I could search and it's like, whoa, here's like the strongest weapon in the entire fucking game. Congratulations. I mean, chances of that happening is very slim, I'm just saying there is a possibility. And I think it's weird that the look and search are... ...very similar. Should be the fight right here. Yep. Holy shit, there's a bunch of people. Might find YouTube if you search the right place? Probably. I mean, he's got to be hiding somewhere, right? Get him, Akeem. It's my boy. Still want to know what the fuck this is.
He's holding the fucking armor in his hands. Ah, this game. He was beating the shit out of people with fucking armor. What a god. Yeah, you wanna see how badass I am? I'll beat the fuck out of you with a piece of leather. Just slap him over the fucking head with the other chest piece. <sighs> I said, like, there's uh, some arrows and apples around here. That wouldn't be bad to grab, but. I have no idea what those are. I've picked up a few before, but I've never really looked at them or used them, so I have no idea what they are. See, I think the potions do different things because there's yellow and red. I think one puts you all the way back up to 100, so I'm not using them very effectively. And uh, I think yellow just flat out gives you health because I can go over 100. Or maybe I can't yet because I mean I haven't leveled up yet, so maybe that's the issue. Alright. I wanted to make sure I searched the entire castle because I can't remember where, where shit was. 
pretty much like the entire castle is empty. It's just a few spots for this stuff. I think there's arrows up here, right? Maybe outside the castle? Whatever. Get off the rock. Man. Get off the Dwayne Johnson. See that last time. That's good because uh, Duncan doesn't have a weapon. Because I'm holding on to my bow, so I've got two weapons on me. This would be an interesting game to speedrun. That was like the very first thing I thought of when I started playing it. I might have an issue, because I think that a lot. Every single time like I load up a game, I'm like, yeah, this doesn't seem like it might it doesn't seem like it'd be too bad to speedrun. If it has decent controls and it's like got an okay play style. So this one you'd have uh, inventory management. And like the weird fights throughout the game. Worst thing about like uh, like routing this game though would just be the search thing because I know if I was to route this game I'd search like everywhere because I'd want to make sure it was as optimal as possible. So just going through like the entire game and searching every fucking inch, make sure there's not like hidden shit that could be helpful. Ocean is right up here. to tell me what the yellow did and the red did. Alright, I got the ring on. I wonder if it'll work in my hand. Hey, there it is. What is going on here, Mary? My father's been killed. People are starving. With King Richard away fighting the Crusades, the sheriff has taken over. The sheriff is bound to look for you here. Head for Sh Sherwood Forest, rumors say. Many men live there, hiding from the sheriff. Robin guards have stormed the castle. Guy and his men take my saddle, pretend to steal two horses, and flee, or they'll kill us all. Ooh, eight damage.
Um, is everybody's inventory full? No, I can't pick up. Are you fucking kidding me? I can't pick this up. Fuck me, dude. Oh, chainmail's gone. You gotta pick this up before you start. You talk to her. Or you can't pick it up. Awesome. That sucks. I just wanted to make sure it fucking worked. Oh well. I'm a god at video games, I don't need chainmail. Set up a horse and leap on. They're right behind us. We must ride or die. We can lose them in the forest if we make it there. Holy shit. Alright. Oh fuck, I'm not seeing the tiny rock. That's the issue. It blends in really well down there. Yeah, right? After a long horse chase, you managed to elude the guards in Sherwood Forest. They say Sherwood is haunted, Master. Either we take our chance to the ghost or become ghosts ourselves. I'm really annoyed by that chainmail, though. It sucks that you have to pick that up before you talk to Marion. It's also dumb the fact that you can throw that fucking uh, ring on the ground. And you need it to get the saddle from her. But yeah, this game actually is it's pretty good. And like you said, it's just got a lot of variety, which is really awkward. Because, I mean, you got this fighting style. Then you got the uh, 1v1 style. Then you got that weird, like, Atari-looking version. And then, also on top of that, you got that um, horse riding that you just had to do. Ugh, my lower back is killing me right now. I just need a, like, I really need a better chair. Like, as long, I sit so much in front of my computer, and I just have a god-awful chair. Plus, I'm old. That's my issue. It's old age. Oh, you young whippersnappers, you wouldn't understand.
That's the only reason I actually want to be like an old guy with uh, gray hair or no hair. Just walk around with a cane and shit, bend over, holding my back. It's just so I can say stupid shit like whippersnappers. And you kids. I don't have big dreams in life, but... Like, I envy the old people that just go to, um... Like... Okay. I envy the old people that just go to, um... Like, coffee shops, or whatever. Like, restaurants, and then just sit there drinking coffee the entire day, just bullshitting. Like, you fuckers. You have made. Why am I... Who? What? I need to go down, right, up. Okay. Right? Like... Dude. It's awesome. I just sit around all day. Drinking coffee. And bullshitting with all their other old friends. And they get to criticize everybody because they're old. So, like, nobody's going to give them flack. Like, when they say, like, Oh, you kids these days, you don't know how good you have it. The kids can be like, Hey, listen here, old fucker. You know, like, they're just like, Yep, you got it easy, old guy. And the old guy's like, Damn right you do. Back in my day, we had to walk uphill through snow both ways to get to school. And we liked it that way. Right? It looks just amazing, dude. And it's funny, it's like, it's funny, like, uh, I just can't picture, like, my generation doing that when they get older. I just picture them just sitting in front of the TV or, um, playing video games when they're older. Well, well, rich man has come to visit us. Welcome to John Little Forest. I have no money for the likes of you, and I suppose that gold medallion around your neck is worthless? It was my father's. It's sacred to me. Sacred to us too, Mush. There, that bear will feed us for a blooming month. Since you won't pay a toll, you have to fight your way across the bridge. Fuck bring him, motherfucker. Watch out, Dad. He walloped the sheriff's men. Is that so? I'm gonna enjoy this. Ooh, you started off hitting me, dickhead. Ooh. Exactly, exactly, which, I mean, still sounds amazing. Ha! Seeing as I made it past the gate, John Little, or should I call you Little John? Ha! 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 I yield. Best sword work I've seen in a long time, Loxley. I recognize your medallion. Come to our camp to meet the rest of the boys. Perhaps you might want to join us against the sheriff. Yes, but to lead you, Little John has joined Robin's band. Well, this is our camp, hidden deep in Sherwood. Camp, a clearing in some trees. Yeah, beyond Sherwood's leaves, we're just a, we're outlaws, but here we're kings. Kings, ha! If you expect to hold out here, you better build some sort of a camp. Robin, someone's here to see you. Please, you must help me, sir. A vile baron has kidnapped my fiance and is forcing her to marry him. Please rescue her. Stopping a wedding may not be an easy thing to do. Do you have any proof of this? I have seen a I have seen a letter from the baron in which he describes his evil plot. It is upstairs in the baron's chambers, but is well guarded. That's 17 HP, man. Seventeen. Woo, boy! We think it is 
best to build tree huts. They are easy to defend against attack. Alright, well, boys, get on it. Can't do everything for you. Robin leaves his camp to stop the Baron's marriage. There's 1v1 battles, I wonder if you can use the bow. Like, if I have it equipped beforehand, you can use the bow, because that'd make it fucking a joke. A joke. Robin Hood advances to the next level. Oh, cool, I'm too hitting these guys now. Oh! Nine damage, that hurt. Testing something. Oh, the attack speed. I don't know if it's mashing speed or what the deal is, but sometimes it's faster than other times. Oh, that hurt. That was a hundred, uh, twelve damage. Oh, fuck you, dude. Thought he was dead. It's weird that I got that torch though, because I don't know what the fuck I'm supposed to use that for. And I get that at the very beginning of the game. <coughs> you must have invitations to attend the Baron's wedding. Oh, well, sorry dude, I don't have invitations. One damage. Yeah, I had a feeling I'd have another fucking fight like this in a second. Oh, that was quick. 
From victory, Robin finds four bandages and two bags of gold among the remains. Oh, that's what those probably are, bandages. Dude, put on- use the stick. What's the matter with you? Just a little bit. Should we use the map walls in here? Alright, this is just six rooms. <coughs> oh, I'm dying. Hey, cool, I lost another follower. <coughs> Alright, so there's that, now I need to head back to the camp. My goodness. Stop coughing. You're not a Pokemon. I need to go back to the camp. I need to talk to this guy. I have selected a rich bride of Mary, once blood or have her fortune signed the Baron. Okay, yeah, that's the uh. Man, it kills me after I've been like streaming for this long. I still get people to unfollow me. So I don't know if those people followed me during the GBE and they're like, dude, yeah, I'm not enjoying this anymore and they unfollowed me. I assume most of the people that unfollow me followed me with Minish Cap way back when. And they're like, why the fuck? Who is this guy? Why am I following him? But it just amazes me that I still have people that might be still following me from way back when that are just now unfollowing me. Where's the... Where do I gotta go? The map. I need to go left, up, left, right. Where's all the enemies at? The shoot. Fucking nose is itching. Like inside my nose. 
which is always fun. I wish getting into the minimap was a little bit quicker. Yeah, I assume most people did, but this is hard work. Presume we'll have a camp. No, fuck. No, go back up. Here to see you, please. Yeah, uh, uh, uh. Seen a letter from Baron. Stairs and back chambers well guarded. I got that? <laughs> Motherfucker! Seen a letter from the Baron in which he described the applause upstairs in Baron's chamber, but is well guarded. Okay, yeah, I got that. Do I need to put it on my chest? Uh, I can't wear the leather. Or letter. Started watching your GB off and on, and I got hooked when shouting answers to the TV with my SO and you played words. <laughs> well, I'm glad that's what did it. Yeah, because I'm pretty sure that was the first time I ever see you, saw you talk too, was the, um, during words app. And it was funny too, because, like, I think you might have talked once before, but it just out of nowhere, and then you've been following, or, um, subbing to me ever since. According to the guide, I don't have to come all the way back to this guy. I just gotta talk to the Baron now, which is stupid. That game was fun though. Word Zap was a pretty fun game. I used to, uh, years and years and years ago, back on JTV, I used to stream um, just random SNES games, and I played uh, Family Feud a lot because I enjoyed. It's a great chat interaction game. Games like Word Zap and Family Feud, so downright. Always fun games to play. It's like I got like that feeling in your chest where you just got something like there and you just can't get it out with coughs. I think that's called death. <laughs> then take both the items off. I have room, you fucking potato stick. Who dares interrupt my wedding? This wedding must not be held. This bride has been kidnapped by the Baron, is being forced into this marriage. <coughs> ha ha ha! And we are to believe an outlaw? I have the proof, a letter from the Baron. I will not tolerate this accusation. Defend yourself! Nope, you can't use the bow. I love the fact that this is a wedding, but he just pulls out a fucking knife. Or, a yeah, knife. 
A sword. Ouch. That's like the easiest way to do this, but you just gotta wait for them to come at you. You may have won this time, Robin, but I shall have my revenge. The sheriff will hear of this. This is why I let you live. <coughs> the wedding is over. Ah! The bride will soon join her true love. Sheesh. driving me nuts. Probably driving everybody nuts too who's listening. <laughs> Alright, so yeah. I just wanted to make sure I gotta get back to the camp. I just didn't want to walk all the way back to the camp and the game be like, oh well no you're supposed to be uh castle for some various reasons. I just knew I was going to duel with the Baron, so I wanted to see if I could uh, use the buff against him, because that would make this fucking fight a joke. <coughs> oh, man. <coughs> it's just like a tickle, like right in the back of my throat. Bottom throat, whatever. And I just... <coughs> Can't get rid of it. I'm gonna cough myself horse at this rate. And you left. Rumors are flying of a huge wild boar that's killing nearby villagers and tearing up their fields. Some of them came to beg our help. Is that all I get? <coughs> I'm trying so hard not to cough into the mic, too. But, like, I'm constantly having to turn. Hunt down the giant boar. Oh, fucking shit. Man, if I'm gonna die, can I just do it fucking quietly? It's ridiculous.
Alright, so I'm just gonna, like, check everywhere for the more. Holy shit, Biscuit! That scared the fuck out of me. That is a giant ass boar. Oh, fucking hell, dude, get off of me. What the fuck was that? That didn't seem fair at all. Here, then I think that was the giant boar. <laughs> I mean, I assume that'd be the giant boar. south for a short errand and never returned. Folks say, well, on the path is haunted. Haunted? Ha! One of the sheriff's work, I suspect. Well, we'll get to the bottom of this. Luck. <clears throat> oh, I can walk right there. That's good. Search for the missing woodsman. is back to the camp. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> sniped, bitch. Hey! Awesome. I wish I healed when uh, I leveled up there. Then went to full HP. I'll be taking that potion.
<clears throat> I'm stuck. Walked into him. Good job. Bravo. Bravo! There we go. Alright. <coughs> Probably down. Hey, what's up? Dead dude. Looks like we found our missing woodsman. I think we should explore this well further. We must find a way down. Rope. I assume. So it's hard to tell where what is a dead end and what's just cut off. So I assume this is all cut off. Just dead ends, you know what I mean? And the uh, area I'm supposed to go all the way to the right. Out of 175, not even close. Um, down or to the top right? Let's go back and get checked down. Yeah. 
Like I said, I can't tell if their screen transitions or like there. It's just a dead end. Fuck. That's where I entered at, apparently. Druids, I can smell them. Well, that's a weird gift. The credits list reads, Converted to the Game Boy and fully recoded by Andy Rogers. What a hero. All graphics and artwork were expertly redrawn in Glorious Grays by John Baker. Thrill to the mu sound of music and, sound and effects by David Whitaker. Project coordinator was Jeffrey the Barrack. That's pretty cool that they actually have an item in the game that you can pick up that uh, has credits. Probably another one. The letter reads, inform the sheriff that we are punishing any villagers to help rob him. Okay. That's a cool way to do the credits list, though. Greetings, Loxley. I'm Mortiana, the witch. The mortal weapons cannot harm my guardian. There's only one weapon that can harm him, and you don't have it. It is I who protects the sheriff. You shall never defeat me, and you shall never get near the sheriff so long as I live. Leave here, and don't ever try to return. Robin, we can't fight this creature yet. Let's get out of here while we can. Alright. down here just to fucking be told that I can't fight somebody yet and I have to leave. Really annoying. It's kind of weird that like everything so far is given one or two experience. Nothing is given more, except for possibly boss fights, but I don't know if they do or not because it doesn't actually say a number after you beat them. Oh, 
Oh, another bow. Holy shit. And that's the whole point of that area to come over here, is another bow. Actually, little John, you kicked my ass with that thing. You can keep it. Duncan, you get a bow. Got two bows. The bow feels really useless, in my opinion. I mean, the upside is the fact that you can, of course, use range to stay away from shit. I feel like you get so many health items anyway. The sword's not that bad. I mean, I've, I haven't really been searching that fucking hard or anything, and I've gotten a ton of health items. I have like five or six potions right now stop, stored up in the heal for a lot. I do think it's weird this game doesn't have like a ability to heal in town or anything. Like literally all your healing is from items throughout this entire game. Robin Murray needs to see you immediately. She said to meet her in a small castle south of here. Shows in the right spot. Quickly, Robin, take this dagger. I stole it from the sheriff. It seemed very important to him. He called it the Druid's Dagger. I think there's something very special about it. Be careful. He's raising an army to go after you. I must flee before he finds me here. Be careful. Alright. There's the item I need to kill the one thing. something. I can't tell what that was. Some bread. I just want to eat here in a second. Get a little bit of extra health. Hey, let me fight you. Come here. Alright. <clears throat> I have so many bandages and uh, potions. It's insane. So I'm saying, like, it's ridiculous how many fucking healing items I got. Uh, 
as quick. Loxley urgent news has reached us since you left. The sheriff's tax wagons are rolling through Sherwood. Loaded with gold he has stolen from his people. We can use money more than the sheriff. We shall take it back. Accidentally came up here, but that's completely useless. Like that, I don't understand the point of that. Leaves the camp to rob the tax carts. So I just gotta go down. See, that's the thing is like, there's so many, so much shit that I'm not even bothered searching for. So there's a lot of potential loot I'm missing out on. These centers are attempting to steal these carts of gold, food, and medical supplies. We meet again, Loxley. Take a good look at the sword, which I will chop you down with. My father's sword. Your father died a coward, cursing your name and squealing like a stuck pig. That's a lie. It was I strung his corpse to the castle wall. My pleasure would be in doing the same to you. Come on, bro. You gotta step forward eventually. Like this, I really no good way to do these fights. Like this is the best way I see to do it. I mean, you can try to just keep going forward and take damage, but. of Gisborne is defeated. The Loxley Sword. I can do 20 points of damage. Oh, won't you? Putting that on there. Which I think we already had one. That's what it looks like at least. Eight points of damage. Now I had a regular old sword. Here you go, Azim. There's probably so much shit I could drop that I just don't. Holy shit, what's that movement speed? Oh, I think that's the potion I drank. Holy mother of god. Keep going down. Well, what's the? Uh... Mm, actually, let's go back and talk to this one guy. What's up, dude? Thank you, Robin Hood, for freeing me. I shall join you and tend to the spiritual welfare of your men. These cards may be the payments. From the sheriff to his barons, we can use the money. Uh, apparently, okay. Friar Tuck has joined Robin's band. Alright, so is there? Do I have to keep going down, fight more? Or is that it? Whoa. Things are going well in camp, Robin. Our camp has grown, but the men are not experienced in the art of fighting. They need a trainer. I've heard a hermit nearby who's a master of any weapon. Let's pay him a visit. Perhaps we can convince him to join us. Hello, Robin. Marion, what are you doing here? I can stay only briefly. I have come to take Duke and back with me to Dubo Dubois. Dubois? Hope we save her there. Goodbye, Robin. Alright. She just showed up just to take one of my uh, crew members. Leaves to find a weapon master. Which, hold on. Son of a bitch! I think I lost items, didn't I? Whatever. Ooh. Probably right there where that X is. Like right in the center, so I need to go up. Right, up, for a while, then left. Up, right. So I need to go up. Right. 
up for a very long time and left as soon as possible. Map makes sure I'm at where I want to be. Yep. Okay. Now I just need to go left and then down. Went from the sword that can do 8 to this that can do 20. The bow's useless. Okay, yep, so I need to check the right and the left. If he's not here, then I assume he's gonna be in, like, the top top right. Which is where I assumed, he, I assumed he'd be at the first, my first thought, but then I was like, oh, there's this big old area here, so... So I need to go up, right, up, left. I need to get out of this area. So, and up, right, up. And then up for a little bit and then left. Son of a bitch! Where is this fucking hermit at? Because <clears throat> I assume he'd just be at one of these dead ends, you know? Not, like, in the middle of nowhere. Like, in the middle of the, uh, lines. Probably a good sign. Water. Hey! Found him. I bid you greetings, sir. I'm Robin of Loxley, and I would like to recruit your services as a trainer. I'll train your men only if you defeat me in battle. Will you challenge me? Oh, you can roll. What the shit? That's dope. Swordsman Robin, my fee is 200 gold pieces. I'll set up for your camp right now, right away. All right, let's get the fuck out of here. Do I have a yellow potion? I think that was what sped me up. Let's see if I do. Red potion. Hey, Friar Tuck, put on that sword, bro. Stored. I needed that though, it was a hundred fucking points of health. Alright, check the map. Ah, down, 
fuck, I can't tell if I can get out from this way, so I guess we're just gonna go right. Probably the long way. Ha! I one hit these guys now. Alright, there's that. Thank goodness you have returned in time, Robin. The flu has spread throughout our camp. The men are all ill. What can be done for them? I know of a mystical pond whose water is said to keep clear in this way all form of sickness. The journey is a dangerous one. I've heard stories of strange creatures who live within its waters. I have no choice. We must leave at once. Oh, wow. Interesting map. Oh shit. Okay. Mm, the bow might be a better choice here, Josh. Yeah, we're gonna fucking put that in his hand. Oh wait, no, I can't put it in his hand. Duh, that's fine. I did hit him with the sword, that's why the first one died so quickly. Alright, that was quick. Alright, let's get rid of this fucking bow. I think you could actually hit the, all those guys with your sword, which would be a lot quicker than <coughs> with the bow, because the sword does so much damage. Thank goodness you have returned in time, Robin flew a spread, motherfucker. Alright, whatever I grabbed wasn't it then. Empty flask. Ooh, that would be why. Alright, well, back to the water. That's really dumb. I figured that, because I, I didn't go up there beforehand, so I thought that dropped after I killed the guys and it was the healing water. Welcome back, Robin. With this healing water, the camp should be strong again very soon. More rumors of the sheriff's evil deeds have reached our camp. Seems that a wicked baron and his army are looting and killing. As they go, a bunch <coughs> of them are heading for a small village. We gotta stop them before they wipe out the village. Ugh, how much longer we got? Cure the camp. Protect the village. Battle of the Celts. Town Hang. Sheriff's Castle. Ending. So we're on 15 out of 19. Still salty about not having that chainmail. 
of the mini-map, or map. Up, and massive left. Probably gonna have to cross that wall, aren't I? Hey, leveled up. Oh, there's another sword. <clears throat> yep, another sword. Looks like we got here just in time. I love how low fucking Azim's health bar is. Pretty sure that's Azim. I've had him since the start, so I imagine he'd be the second health bar. Victory! Robin finds a chest key, two bags of gold, and some leather armor among the remains. And that's all the guards. Here you go, buddy. Well, I mean, you could eat bandages. I'm being a bitch about it. I don't know, because I just used it on him. Try to use it on him, but uh, I don't think he healed. This is our last meeting, Loxley. You have disrupted the plans for the last time, peasant. You interrupted my wedding and caused me great embarrassment. I stole my money from the tax carts and I was sent it to the sheriff. Now invade the village I am looting. This is more than any man can tolerate. Please, you flatter me. Let's finish it now. I love how I'm just like running through this game. I'm just hoping that everything works out well. Because I assume that now he's gone. Because like the, after you get to the camp, it's just like, hey, do this little tiny task and then go back to the camp. So that's all I've been doing is just running straight to the task and completing it. Because if you just check the map, it's usually pretty obvious where everything is. The uh, trainer was like the hardest one to find so far.
Master Robin, Master Robin, Duncan, what are you doing back here? Sheriff attacked the boy, took Marion, I escaped. I warned you, he took Marion. Yes, plans to marry her because she is of royal, royal blood. Robin, there are hundreds of Celts coming. We are doomed. Old foals led them right to us. To arms, man the defenses. We give an old fool, Master Robin. How the fuck did you find us when you're blind, dude? I don't even care, I'm impressed. And it kills me because I'm going through this game so easily and I don't even have the uh, iron mail because I accidentally fucked that up. So I, I could be going through the game even easier. And then add in the fact that I'm also not searching really hard for uh, potions and apples and whatnot. Holy shit, I lost a guy. About to lose another one. Managed to piece some celts, but more can be seen rushing forward. We have to get Robin, they're done. I was standing, we gotta hide and regroup. After they've gone, then we'll figure our next move. Our dead cry out for revenge. The sheriff must pay for this. Buggers set fire to the trees. They're trying to roast us alive. We will retreat for now. That was a battle, battle we could never have won. How did we do? Most of us made it out safely, but they took a few of us prisoner. We must return to our camp and plan our next action. Alright, so where the fuck am I at? Oof, I gotta go down and then right. Again, I'd say right and down. Yep, left, down, right, down, left, down, right, down. camp that's fucking destroyed. I've been told that the sheriff's going to hang ten of our men at noon today unless you surrender. Now is the time for our final battle. To free our friends and get rid of the sheriff. We ain't doing nobody no good here. Let's get this over with. I don't know why I went this way. For the final showdown with the sheriff. Up again. Ugh. Down, right. Down, right, up, right, and then massive down. Okay, I'm just gonna follow this path. Here we ride. Shit. Well, thank goodness I kept a hold of the saddle. Or did I? Because I don't have it on my person, but I know I've lost people. Okay, good. Whew. That would have pissed me off. 
That would have pissed me off. I don't understand the bandage. Because I just bandaged myself and I went from 117. I think I was at 117. Like the, I don't think the bandages do a whole lot. Anywho. Fucking riding a pony over here with these ups, man. It's ridiculous. Now, what, ha what happens if I hit a rock? Because I'm not getting chased by anybody. It says, like, I hit a rock, I just take a spill, we get up, put some bandages on, and then just walk it. Looks over here just in time to stop the hanging. John, why do you have so many bandages, dude? It's weird. I'm at 117. Your bandage your wounds. Yeah, bandages do like nothing. <clears throat> they took me from 117 to 125. It's Robin Hood! Call up the guards! Seize them! They've recognized us! Oh, was we supposed to be incognito and I just lost a guy? Get up. I lost another guy. I don't know why I'd ever bother healing them when I can just heal myself. And if they die, it's like, yeah, whatever. Finds two bags of gold among the remains. But the big question is, uh... I, I, I don't get it. Oh, okay, yeah, he died and he's at 1 HP. He died and he's at 1 HP, so like, they stay here. So, I mean, there's still inventory space. Oh, I'm gonna bandage my wounds. Cause like, that's the only reason for having multiple people is those little fights, but I mean, I don't- they're not even that difficult. I barely take damage during them. They just help you clear everything quicker. Fire talks got a potion. Alright. Get rid of that. I'm trying to just shuffle all the healing items into my inventory. I think it's dumb that you got like uh, these three spots that still have nothing in them. And I also think it's dumb that I've had a key and a torch that I've been holding the entire fucking time. Alright, there we go. Now, how do I get there and stop the execution? I'm coming, boys. Just let me figure out how to get up there. Don't, don't die. Hey, don't die. I'm coming. I uh, just, you know, hold on. Is there stairs to this? Hey, guys. Hey, do you see stair? No. Guys, you gotta help me a little bit. Help me help you. Guys, no. The sheriff to wed made Marion's day much against her will, I'm told. I don't know, like, did I just save them and then I just gotta walk away now? Like, eh, fuck it, you know. Good luck, guys. You can get yourselves down, right? Alright, so I assume I'm looking for a building then. Those are the poor blokes the sheriff's gonna hang today. Poor sobs. Did he just seriously say SOBs? Did this game seriously just throw in SOBs? Poor sons of bitches. I think I do need to rescue these guys. Nope, okay, here we go. Maybe this is it. 
Be gone, strangers, and never you swine are permitted in the castle. Well, not with that attitude, I'm not. Uh, that's funny, I'm not. FAQ, Sheriff's Castle, items found here, lots. Don't try to grab them all, go straight to the last battle. Alright, it says, like, I'm supposed to. In I don't know. It says I'm supposed to start a melee battle when I try to enter, and then I'm supposed to be in it. Yeah, it says, like, when you try to enter the castle, you'll start a melee battle. And then, it pretty much says I'll be in the castle after that. I'll hold my switch to the other guide. Because it's a little bit more detailed. Oh, apparently I, when I got to the town, I was supposed to drop the saddle, take off my arm, and put on the disguise. I'm supposed to do something I've done a million times. I'm supposed to just melee this guy. <laughs> I've meleeed guards like a million times and it's never done anything, so I just gave up on doing it. I was actually supposed to melee. Because you're supposed to put on a disguise and just go straight up to him and then melee him. <sighs> oh, about to lose another guy. There he goes. These fucking are all dead. There we go. Victory! Woo, let's storm the cast before reinforcements arrive. Now, my friend, is the time for the final battle. The gate has closed behind us. This place has an evil smell. We must find Marianne quickly. Don't hurt me, Sheriff. It is at the rear of the castle. Uh, I need to go. Just keep going straight until I run into a dead end, then come back, and then right. I'd like to pick up some healing items on here. I don't really need them, because I got, I think, two potions in my inventory right now. But just because I like one more like potion not like bandages because bandages are fucking useless alright so oh the fucker stop shooting me so I need to come back down and then go to the right potions still. So, right, all the way right, then all the way up, run to a dead end, come back, down, and then go right again. Pretty sure this is going to be the dead end right here. Nope. Okay, so this will be the dead end. Yep. Oh, shit. That's not good. I figured they'd be, uh... Okay, never mind. What are you doing here? You got no business in the sheriff's castle. Guard, seize them. Here we go again. God damn, another battle like this? Ever kill much game?
Jesus Christ. Definitely need healing items. Bloomin'. I thought they'd never stop coming. Feel a surge of energy rushing into your body. So there's the speed. Hit points about 65. That's not good. Alright, 165. That's better. I really need some more healing items. We made again lost so this time you will not escape. You know, if the sheriff is behind me, all I can do is get by me. Oh. Alright, so I need the... Uh, I think it's this one. Better be this one. Because it might have been on somebody that. It might have been on What's His Face that left my team. Fuck. I might have actually just soft locked the game again. I think I actually soft locked the game again at the very end of the game. Because I'm supposed to have the uh, druid's dagger, and I don't think I do, because I think it's on somebody else. Because uh, I lost that one guy, because he left my team. And I think he had the druid's dagger in his hand, or in his inventory. Yep, I don't have the druid's dagger on me anymore. fucking kidding me game are you fucking kidding me how stupid unless it's literally this dagger which I don't think it is because I mean yeah, it says knife I, I... And this is seriously like the end of the fucking game. I think I'm just gonna call it beat. I mean, all I have to do is this skeleton, I beat him, and then I have a duel with the sheriff. Which, the duels are a fucking joke, because you just stand there, and then it's, a, it's fucking credits. I really don't feel like playing through this game again, because I fucking accidentally fucking lost the dagger. Why? Why is that an option, dude? I lost. I've had to fucking play through this. Jesus fucking Christ Almighty!
Yep, fuck it, I'm calling it. Yeah, um, so you know how, like, I dropped the ring earlier? And I pretty much soft locked the game because I couldn't actually get the saddle because of it. So there's a dagger you have to go and get. I got that, and I put it- I left it on somebody. I didn't bother worrying about the equipment because I didn't think I was going to lose the inventory slots. That guy got taken off of my team, and he had the fucking dagger. So I cannot beat the game. And this is seriously the very end. Like, I go up here, I kill the skeleton, and then I have a duel. And the fucking duels are a goddamn joke. So I have the skeleton fight followed by a duel. And that's all I have left. So I'm just calling it done. I'm not going to fucking waste my time going through this entire game again just because I fucking didn't have the dagger on myself. Yeah, that's two there's two different ways you can soft lock the game. It's it's absurd. When you get the ring, yeah, if you get the ring and you um drop it, you soft lock the game. And if you get the dagger and either drop it or put keep it on the one guy cuz you have four people in your party, one, the, uh, what's-her-face shows up and says, hey, I'm taking this guy with me. He ends up actually coming back, but you don't get him to join your party. He just shows up and says, hey, uh, yeah, they took her, I need your help. So you don't actually get him back in your party, but he has the druid dagger in his inventory. And it's funny because uh, I just I just typed in uh, on this guide I just did Control F and I typed in the word Druid and his uh, he has a my strong suggestions number eight don't give the Druid's daggers to Duncan and don't mistake it for a knife the reason why Duncan the blind guy that lost his eyeballs he's the one that you uh, get that gets taken off your team so if you notice, there's Robin Hood, Little John, Friar Tuck, and Azim. So I don't have Duncan anymore, and that's who had the fucking knife. I didn't actually choose it. I just, my inventories were all full up, so like it went to him. It went to Duncan, and he got taken off my team. So the game is off-locked. Ah, oh, this fucking game. Alright, well that's going to be it for me today. Um, this wasn't too bad of a weekend. I got a few games in. One... I did 11 games, not too bad. Um, this one... This one soft locked twice on me. Uh, Paperboy 2 I gave up on. I might actually have to go back to. Um, 10 10 I save stated right at the very end. And Tech Bowl was bullshit. But other than that, it wasn't too bad. Um, so everybody, you guys have a great week. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys uh, next weekend. I actually have no idea what games I'll be playing, but I will roll some new games here later today. So if you check my um, my Google spreadsheet, you'll actually be able to see what games we'll be streaming next weekend. So uh, yeah, see you guys.